Friday is National Bike to Work Day, and with all the nice weather, you may be thinking about trading your four wheels for two when it comes to your commute. But sharing the road with motorists comes with some risk. The Now Buffalo's Brittany Muller has some tips for staying safe. It's about nine and a half miles each way. That's an 18 mile round trip that Matthew Anger is biking from his Cheektowaga home to South Buffalo for his job every day. I burn like twice as many calories at least as the average person. He's been commuting on his bike since the 70s. America has sort of developed a car culture and uh, everybody thinks that they really need a car to get around and uh, they really don't. And anger is a prime example. So now during this bike to work week, he's encouraging others to try their commute on two wheels rather than four. Ride your bike to work day is Friday, uh, it's technically, but for me, ride your bike to work day is every day. The League of American Bicyclists say all trips made in the U.S. are less than two miles away, making biking a feasible option. Everybody out there has a bike in their garage that, uh, that they can use. Anger says biking to work is not just good for your health and the environment. It's also good for your wallet when you factor in how much you can save on gas. Perhaps that's why the number of people biking to work in the U.S. grew from 2000 to 2013 by more than 60 percent. Some tricks. I try to make sure I ride at least three feet from the curb. I watch out for potholes and uh, other hazards in the road. And for the equipment, Anger says. Getting a wrap around UV protected shades, a hard shell helmet. And gloves are important. I have a blinking light in the back so that drivers can see me. Find a good route, try riding the work, and then just see if you can do it. And you'll enjoy the health benefits and get the satisfaction of helping the environment. For the Now Buffalo, I'm Brittany Muller.